um, hey, Ashley, good start here. Um, yeah, I'm going to need you to, to submit with these um, in the right direction. You can just rotate them before um, before you put them in the PDF, just because I, I really can't even do feedback, um, you know, because they're on their side. It's, well, it's pretty um, obvious. But so anyway, um, the first thing I wanted to mention is that if you're going to choose um, Computer Chris, all of all of the, the parts need to be um, computer parts. So need to have the head computer. Um, this you know you know the body needs to be something um, computer related. Um, same with this one. I'm not sure what this one's supposed to be. Um, you know you have I think like five or six choices. So um, no cat heads and you know. Um, pants and a shirt it, ha it has to be completely created with computer parts um um yeah same with all of them they're just maybe you misunderstood the example um now this one's really cool with these these kind of um cables for legs i think that's really cool and so basically what you need to do is is just get rid of the parts that aren't computer and find some other images that um or objects that um fit into that okay so um and again another thing i wanted to mention i'm going to show you some examples um you know this one too has some cool you know the cables look pretty cool just need to have everything else um you know um related to the same um to the computer um i like how this is kind of a side view so that's that's really cool and that's another thing um, I wanted to, I'll show you some examples. A lot Students at first usually do everything in one point perspective, just the head on view. Um, so let me find these, these examples. Um, so um, again, this is, this is somebody, this is a past student work of the, this is the computer Chris one. And again, note how all the, the objects are, you know, related to something with the computer, but notice the um, use of the two point perspective, even three points, we're seeing the top side and two, two other sides. So um, just something to think about. This one too, um, again, the side view really works to, to make it, um, you know, look more alive and more animated. Um, and note again, the smaller, um, you know, smaller makes things look like they're more in the background. So, um, you know, that's one reason why there's a nice sense of depth. Same here with this little leave arm. It's further away. Um, and again, notice the leg here. But see how all the the caricatures are all made of computer parts. Um, so, um, again, but again, see the two sides. It really makes it look like, like it has depth. Here's the toy one. Um, you know, he, he really... The, the text is just too much. It's dominating the caricature. But overall, he did a really great job on the caricature. Um, and this one, too, again, just, you know, I mean, the Game Boy's thin, but this side, you know, you can see two sides. And again, the back wheel and back arm are smaller. Um, same with this one. Um, same here, smaller leg. And you don't have to have the same legs. And it, again, the different angle of view on this really makes it effective. Um, same here with, um, you know, smaller in the background. It could have been a little bit smaller. Um, you know, this is kind of what we're working towards, and we'll also create a background. And again, here's another one of the computer. And, and I like how you made the, this kind of a, you know, tail and this little head thing with all these cables. And again, monitor, you know, I mean, the typewriters don't really fit in, but, um, you know, he got docked a little bit of points for that. He could have put keyboards or something, um, just because these obviously aren't computer related. Again, um, more than five objects, so feel free to use more than five. Um, and again, this one too, computer related. This one's really came out well in terms of the how the objects fit together, um, and then it really works with the background. Um, so, um, yeah, I hope this helps, you know, a little bit, you know, showing you some examples. But I would really suggest that you, um, number one, change some of these so um, they meet the specs um, and turn these two around because I can't really even look at them. But it's, you know, you're probably going to not like your grade if you don't do a little bit more work on these and some submit them. 
you know, because we're not submitting our final till Wednesday. So you have a couple more days and let me know if you have any questions about it. I'm on, um, Google Hangouts all the time. So if you have, I mean, so if you have a question, that's probably the quickest way to get it answered. Um, email's fine too, or the questions thread. Um, okay. So hope this helps.